Thou shalt not break the rules. Welcome back to another episode of Sunday Brunch. Now, there are some people in this world that are very, very passionate, very passionate. about brunch. Now, I do. I like brunch myself, I, I might yes. say. Um, but we might have been doing it wrong. We could have been brunching wrong. After. If you're not going to follow the brunch rules, get don't, out. Don't go to brunch. Uh-uh, no. We, there, will be no, yes. there will be no brunch breaking of the, any kind of rules. The brunch, I mean, the, it's a breed of people that are brunch. Oh, it's, look. And they are passionate. Mm -hmm. Okay. Come on. So you just got to be careful what you step into now. All right. So so here here we have the rules. So brunch is it's it is more than just a mid morning meal. Yes. If you think it's just a mid morning meal, no. Nah. You can go ahead and leave. Okay. Yeah. You can go ahead and leave. This is serious stuff. Okay. So now everybody knows that when you order your food, what's the first question they ask? What would I like to drink? That's what I'm talking about. You must, you you must, meaning this is a necessity that you have an unusual amount of coffee, juice, water, or in some cases alcohol to accompany your food. So, embracing the free refills as well. Oh yes, if you do, if you are missing out on 50% of brunch. If you do not embrace exactly. the refills. Okay. I'm not. I'm not gonna play myself when it comes to no. it comes to brunch. So mimosas is that's perfectly fine. They're okay for brunch. Okay. But, Why is that? Uh, because it's got juice in it. That's like that's like half kind of. I got you. Kind of you know like a half and half thing. Yeah, it's so, like an Arnold Palmer so, just with alcohol. So if you want to have something with milk, go right ahead. All right, I but, got you. But get, get this, scotch. Mm -mm, that's a no no. You, that is no a big scotch. no no. Okay. See, you feel so enlightened already, I, don't you? I've been doing it wrong. We've been, <laughs> we've been doing it wrong the whole time. And so we were discussing brunch back and forth, when it starts, when it might finish. And we were thinking brunch starting around about 9.45 and finishing about 11. Before that, you've got breakfast and you've got lunch. It's very distinct. You <laughs> cannot mix these up. And so if the restaurant, you know, you can't go in there at 9.30 and say you're having brunch. That's still breakfast. Mm. No, nope. right. you got to be there 9:45 between 11. You can't you can't be outside of there. That's a big discussion. Can you have like a burger for brunch? Mm. And and you know most people just call that sausage. But interesting enough, there is more of the word lunch in brunch than there is a breakfast. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, read, read it off you, to him. Read it off to him. Allows you more leeway to eat lunch food. So if you want to have a burger. That's fine. Make sure it's got some bacon or some eggs or something on it. Within, why are you it putting it? An why would you ruin a good hamburger throwing an egg on? Okay, it? well, just bacon. Okay, I can that, live with I this. Can live I with can that. live with this. All right. Read the menu in route. You have to be coming into this mess with an you attack got, plan. I mean, agenda. Write down. You got to know what you're. Getting. I mean, this is this is war. This is war. Yes, you get in there and you better fight for your food, boy, because there's a lot I, of people I, in I, there. I fight for my food. I like some. Mm. I'm assuming there's a line between taking advantage of and like totally being a pig. Yeah, you can't be a pig at brunch. I mean, this is, we're talking I'll go, I'll go. kind of thing here. I am confused. I'm genuinely confused. Okay. In another article that cites the rules, mm -hmm, yes. it says gorging is allowed. It's encouraged, in fact. Wow. Think of it this way. It's two meals in one, so you best stock up. See, now I think, I think... I mean, that's good reasoning. That is excellent reasoning. It is. I don't think you should go off and gorge yourself, though. Like most people, these people have got some discrepancy between the rules. Yes. The, the, the rules, yeah. okay? So I say we just go ahead and clear this up. If you have to waddle out the door after brunch, you're doing it wrong, okay? No waddling. No waddle. That's what I'm saying. Mm. You need to sit on the throne for a little bit, that's fine. Well, you don't, I mean, if you, look, but if you, oh my, I'm not even going to address that. That's my not good. Word. Whew. All can't. right. The biggest day of brunch. I mean, I'm talking 
like the Christmas of brunch is Mother's Day. Mm. You know, you've got your mom and you're trying to serve her. And so a lot of times what we do is we make brunch for our mom and bring it to her in bed. Um, I thought that was called breakfast in bed. Well, if you do it between 9.45. Okay, so it's brunch in bed. Do you know there's a next level for brunch? There is a I step did it, but I up. hope you're going to tell me about step, it. Step, oh, I am. Step up, and it is called a power brunch. It's called a power brunch. Power brunch is, this is for like, it's hosting like a wedding, all right, or a baby shower. Now, do you have to be a part of this? I think do, you do. Does it, it says to, hosting. Does so it have to be power. your baby? I'm gifted to, 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 to Now, if you if you're hosting a power oh, brunch, does that call, make what you What do you call? The uh, power brunch Power brunch dist? But but did you see does that make you are you of higher level in the brunch world if you if you host a brunch? I think you are, and I think they should have medals or little ribbons or name tags like for, distinction for like for I brunch. am a power brunch goer. Yes, like a shirt. I have power brunched. And then when you walk in, you know that dude is like, Oh, like a sticker. Like when it says, I voted. I get power brunched. I power brunched today. And that would, I, you walk in and man, I would respect that man who power brunched. Oh, sure. Don't try to pretend. Like you know the rules. Then you oh, look stupid. It, don't try to pretend that you are a power bruncher. Yeah. Or a power brunch dist if you are not. So brunch fraud, that's a big deal. No brunch fraud. <laughs> Gosh, I can't even believe people would do that. I'm I'm hurt. Okay. Like here I am following the rules of brunch. You these... try so hard. Mm -hmm. You try so hard and people just ruin it. Well, I think that's it for today. Thanks for stopping by for this episode of Sunday Brunch. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. Don't forget to drop a comment down below. Ask us any questions you want. Or even drop us a suggestion. Maybe you'll see it sometime on Sunday Brunch. All right, see, see you, you next then. Week.